Slide into position for the opening draw. The Lightning have won the opening face-off and take possession here at the start. And that's broken up by Barkov. And now it's grabbed by Reinhardt. And that goes off a body. Oh, what an effort as he lays out for the block. Slides it up to Merhage. Slides the puck across to Barkov. From the point, they take control of it. They score! And just like that, it's a 1-0 hockey game. Well, they started like a freight train, just steamrolling their opponent, James. I, I mean, they really dictated right from the onset of this game. That tells me one thing. They were prepared coming in. When you get these grade-A scoring chances nice and tight to the net. you got to find a way to convert on it, but you have to be aware of where the goaltender is. You don't have much time. You have to have quick hands, but you have to find the back of the net when there's not much room. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Panthers have taken a 1-0 lead. And they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Hedman. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Quick pass to Kucherov. The Panthers have the puck now. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. And he had the answer on that one. Moves it over to Hagel. Hedman's got the puck along the wing. Here's a short pass to Point. Sends the pass down low. And he slides it quickly to Shiri. And he takes a shot. And that goes off a stick. And it's turned aside by Bobrovsky. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net as he's trying to trap and find the puck at all costs. It almost looks easy for him, but that's an impressive save. Across the line from center. Here's a chance to the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Puck is frozen, and we'll get a face-off. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Taken by Paul. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Won the draw in the neutral zone. The Panthers take it along the wall. Quick feed to Montour. That's blocked. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Sorelli. And now he moves it past him all. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the boards. Florida's got control of it now from their own end. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum, and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. The Panthers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. First power play opportunity of the game. You know they've worked on this in practice, the setup, the look that they want. Let's see how they move the puck around the perimeter and look to attack. And the puck clears the zone. Cutting to the front of the net. Scores! No mistake on that one. The clinical power play goal. Well, this is just a sweet set of hands and a fabulous deep to get the goaltender out of position and then slide it in right by the post. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The Panthers now lead by two. The Bolts win the draw here in the neutral zone. Great heads up play with the stick by Montour. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Takes the feed moving in. Shot off the outside of the iron and will play on. The Panthers get some emotion from the bench as they look to extend their lead and hit the post and out. Everyone thought it might have gone in and then they realize it didn't. Tries to get the puck to Mikolov. Gaining momentum up along the side. 
shot. Too much traffic in the lane. Near the blue line and looks to set up at the point. From behind the net. Big time save with the block. Made the stop on the play. The bolts carried along the wall. Tampa Bay's got it now. Can't connect as it goes off a stick. And that's blocked away. Oh, and he makes another save. Tremendous intensity here in the offensive zone. Puck picked up by Kachuk. Centering feed. And that's stopped. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The Panthers lead this one 2 zip. Florida's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Strong defensive effort. Moves the puck down low. Here's a blast! Oh, he stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save. Incredible, James. And these fans are still buzzing about what we just saw. What a save that was, Cheryl. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. Here's a blast! Steps in with the block. Turn that one aside. And look at this. They really ratcheted up the intensity here. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. The bolts are going to be short-handed as they are called for tripping. Florida's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Well, they've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. The man is if ineffective. Made that stop. Hagel's got it in the defensive end. Slides the puck across to Perbix. Sends a pass over. The Bolts will play the puck from behind the net. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Bobrovsky. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the... Off oh, the outside of the post and stays out. To the front. Grabbed along the board by Paul. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Moves it to Reinhardt. And a stick in the lane to flex that one away. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Where Higgy's got it against the boards. Big touch save! Oh my goodness! Well, go technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Uh, they always say to be great, you have to get uncomfortable as we look at this last save. This looks uncomfortable. Stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Big face-off coming up here in the offensive zone. Well, after that last shift with sustained pressure, you know that the goaltender is fatigued. You got to find ways to get pucks to the net. Puck grab by Montour. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky's compete level is what makes him so exciting to watch, guys. His contortionist zone ability is when he uses those last-ditch, all-out desperation saves to get in front of the puck. Sorelli's almost back on the ice. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. James, the PK was a specialty team that I actually played on, and the good, aggressive habits there, and it leads to the kill. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Vasilevsky's dialed in and able to redirect that puck to the corner. Scores! They strike again, and that's three unanswered goals. Over and over and over again, James, and you can see the excitement on the bench. They know that they've deflated, and they push their opponent back on their heels. They need to keep plugging away here and not get complacent. the better team here in this first period and as a result they've got a big lead
The Panthers win the faceoff. Moves it on over to Cousins. And he loses control here. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it along the wall. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. Takes the stretch pass in the open ice. He's got a step. And it's broken up with a great defensive effort there. Oh, that's what you call backtracking with a purpose, James. He thought that he was alone and in the clear, and the opportunity gets taken away. That one misses and will play on. Well, you spend so much time trying to create scoring chances, and when you do, you got to find the back of the net. At the very least, hit it, James. There's a shot. Nice save from point blank range. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Stamkos is the leader of this team. He is their captain. They've been behind the eight ball, behind all game. They've got to find a way to get back with this offensive zone faceoff. One goal can create some momentum. Florida's got the puck in their own end. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Tosses it to Paul. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Handles the pass. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Slides the pass over to Stamkos. Feeds the puck across to Shiri. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Kachuk's the player you need to expect the unexpected from, guys. His itch tricky zone ability is that willingness to try highly skilled plays during games to score. Kucherov's known for making clean, crisp passes. His tape to tape zone ability means he can set up his teammates with ease. One of these players is going to help give their team the upper hand tonight. Guys, back to you. Florida's got the puck here in the open ice. Rocks him. The Panthers gain possession. Picked up along the wall by Hedman. The Bolts get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Hedman. Puck is on and off his stick in a hurry, and it needs to be from that low zone slot area. James just beats the goaltender because it gets off his stick so fast. The Lightning have fallen behind in this one, but they're showing some signs of life now. There's always a way back in the game, in particular when you're in the first period, but you have to find an energy and really a collective effort with good habits if you want to fight your way back in. Florida's got the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Ekman Larson. Florida's moving it into the offensive end. And a big time save on a big time shot. Scores! And I think he put this in on his own. Well, uh, he did, James, and this is so deflating when you put it in on your own and you can just see the body language. He is not happy. Oh, that's a really tough goal, James. You can see the frustration on his face and the body language. Just thinks he lost track of it as it found the back of the net. The Panthers have been all over them, and there's still plenty of time left in this first. Tampa Bay's come up with possession after that neutral zone draw. Taken along the wall by Chernak. All alone! Scores! It's in the back of the net! A pair of goals just 20 seconds apart. Cheryl, you stress consistently. Keep your feet moving on the ice, and that pays off. Well, they got the pedal to the metal right now. They're like a freight train. Looks over his shoulder and the presence of mind to know where everyone is and keeps moving forward. And what a finish that is on net. Florida's going to want to take this lead into the first intermission. They have really looked sharp tonight. And they've got the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. The Panthers have been the better team tonight by far. I mean, this is coming right off of without the puck. They know when to close, they know how to intercept, and it's all because of their awareness and stems from their positioning. 
Picks off the pass. The Panthers pull him up the win. Oh, did the rink rattle after that collision in the corner? Oh, and a smart heads up play. Ekman Larson's made an incredible play right there. I mean, he's stumbling. He looks like he's going to fall almost, but he's off balance, and that's the key. The puck isn't exactly where he wants it, but he still manages to find a way to get a shot off. Puck moved over to Reinhardt. White up Main Street and on the attack. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. I'm James Harry. The Panthers scoop it up along the boards. Picking up some steam at center ice. Oh, a solid heads up play to knock it down. From off the wall and onto a stick. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Steps into all of that. The Panthers Change take it across the line. Sends a pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Perfix. Can't hang on to the puck after taking it off. Puck scooped up by Stamkos. The Bolts looking against the half wall. Tampa Bay's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Oh, great save there! Steps across the blue line. Picked up along the boards by Bennett. Good hit on the play. Paul's got the puck now in his own end. The Lightning have it in their own zone. Stamkos has the puck against the half wall and makes the routine save. The Panthers take over on possession. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Fires it! Denies him! Johansson's a great goaltender who understands where the threats are, and this one's in the slot area, and he manages to get to position and make the save. A lot of people excited as this opening period comes to an end. One of the all-time great rock acts from the 80s getting set to play here for these fans. And we'll catch our breath. Back with more in a moment. If you want to show us your accuracy, register now for our Shoot to Win contest. Both teams with a chance to recharge and refresh in this second period about set to get underway. It was quite the one-sided tilt in the first 20 minutes. Let's see if that continues here in the second. Slides it across to Reinhardt. And that's picked off. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Slick feed. The Bolts played along the boards. Jocelyn for the puck, but still moves away. Scores! Well, they've got a belt to climb, but they at least have started the escalation. Well, yeah, they're not at the base of the mountain anymore, but I'll tell you, they're looking up, and it's a long way to go. They're going to have to dig in, put their work boots on if they want to claw their way back into this one, James. I hear coaches preaching all the time, take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck. And now it's grabbed by Hedman. Break away! I love his awareness on this breakaway. His head is up the entire way, and he's reading exactly what the goaltender is giving him. He sees some daylight, quick release shot, and he buries it. The Bolts finally get one back. Now can they get a few more? Well, uh, you certainly know that you can get back in a game. Only a two-goal deficit, and sometimes it doesn't take long when you're on your toes and you're playing with urgency. Paul's won the draw. Let's see what they can do with possession. Pokes it away in his own end. Oh, he'll feel that one. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Moves the puck over to Reinhardt. Bobrovsky's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that far. I think he's been doing gymnastics in his off time.
effective at stick checking and playing solid D in his own end, guys. His stick em up zone ability means he can use his twig to disrupt attackers. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Passes out front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Bobrovsky's going to keep and hang on for the whistle and just slow it down a little bit here. As a goaltender, you always have to be mentally focused and ready to make a save, James. He hasn't been busy this period, but they're in the lead, so it's a safe play he elects to hold on. Grabs the puck. Takes the feed. And he takes the pass. Trapper saved, didn't get all of it, but still enough. Looks to make a play over Tassimo. Florida's looking to break out of their own end. Taken by Kachuk. Florida's got it along the wall. The Bulls have it now. Dishes it, Tassimo. Right in front. And then you have these goals that wind up in the back of the net. He deposited it himself, and that's a real tough one to handle. This next shift, this next save, it's huge. Tampa Bay's found some offense, and now they suddenly have made this game a lot more interesting here in the second. And they changed the momentum. You can see it in the body language and the confidence. They've got themselves within striking distance of an even game. Sends the feet in front, and that's stopped. Rodriguez moves it ahead. Sends it in deep. The Bulls have it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Hagel. And that's knocked away by Lusterinen. Takes the puck. Denied by the goaltender. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Points a warrior, and he knows the importance of sticking with it when the team is down, guys. Look to him to try to use his zone ability to spark the offense here. The Bolts win that offensive zone faceoff. Here he is in front! And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Sent into the offensive zone. The Bolts gain control of the puck against the wall. Hagel's taking it from his own end. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. Puts it on net, and that's turned aside by Bobrovsky. Tampa Bay's got it behind the net. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Bobrovsky's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. Florida's message was clear coming into this one. Lots of shots on net, and they lead here in this second. Steps in and takes the puck. Comes up with the steal. Verhage's got the puck. Right in front, and that goes off a stick somewhere in traffic. The Panthers gain possession along the wall. Takes a shot. He scores! Oh, wow, that's how you do it. Well, he's in close quarters, James. That's what he's known for. He gets that puck on his stick, his head is up, and he buries it in the back of the net. How many times have we seen him score from here, James? In tight to the net. He doesn't need much time. All he has to have is hands ready, and he'll bury it. The Panthers have extended the lead to two now here in the second. Yeah, and sometimes as an athlete, you take a bit of a breather here, and sometimes that frees you to continue to play an attack, but sometimes it leads to complacency. You don't want to give any edge to your opponent when you have them down. The Bolts get a hold of the puck along the boards. Sends it quickly to Paul. Pumps the puck away. Passes on over to Verhage. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Quick feed to Barkov. Answered the call on that play. Now the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Across the line. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. And he denied him there. 
Goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. The Panthers take possession off the faceoff. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. The Bolts gain control of the puck. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Centering feed! And that doesn't connect. With the blast! Denies him on the one-timer! Oh, they do it again! Goaltender covers up and will get a face-off. The Panthers come up with the defensive zone draw. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Textbook poke check by point. The Bolts move the puck in the defensive zone. Takes the feet at the back end. Stones him in front. Sends the pass over. And there's another stop. Oh man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. Great stop by Wawoski. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. Slowing strikes here in Tampa tonight. I love that he pounced on the puck right after the defensive zone turnover. He wanted to make good out of that costly turnover, and he does, sliding it right inside the post. The Lightning have looked out of this one for the most part, but suddenly they're right back into it after that strike. They're able to cut their deficit in half, and they've stayed the course, James. The ability to be hard on the puck focus. They're pushing hard to get the equalizer. Across the line along the left wall. The Lightning have taken control of the puck. The Panthers take possession of the neutral zone. Florida's got the puck in the defensive end. Grabbed along the board by Mikola. And he makes the save. Puck picked up by Listerinen. The Lightning have gained possession off the wall. Moves it to Kucherov. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Fires it on net. And there's the save. Stamkos plays it along the wall. Quick shot. And he's got the answer for that one. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Stamkos. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Bobrovsky's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. Florida's gonna start with the puck in their own end. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Bolts have it now. Pushes it across to Bore Boulay. Mott's gonna play it against the half wall. Cuts to the paint, and that doesn't reach the net. Florida's across the blue line. Quick pass to Glenn Denning. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Makes the save, but barely with that one. The pass in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Barkov's yoink zone ability is his prowess for takeaways, guys. He knows if he steals the puck, he can turn the tables and put his team on the attack. Florida's got it in the defensive zone. Looks to get the puck over to Reinhardt. Great puck check on the reach. That's a good heads-up play at center ice. Florida's got the puck against the half wall. Johansson's gonna hang on for a whistle. Tampa Bay's had a lot of good looks on net, but they continue to trail here in the second. Nice job tying up his opponent. 
The Bolts are on the attack. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Dumps it in. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Radish. Great feed from the left side. And that pass goes off the stick. Florida's in transition. And the puck leaves the zone. They'll be forced to regroup at center. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. And from off the wing, it comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Centering pass, and that's intercepted. Carries it in. Here's a short pass to point. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Moves the puck across to Kachuk. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Florida's got the puck. Here's a chance at front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. The Bolts have had their chances, but they still trail late in the second. Smart play to take possession, sneaking in off the wing. Johansson's gonna give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Receives the pass. Quick feed to Paul. Oh, how did he get a piece of that to make the save? Well, he makes an incredible save on a point-blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Florida's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, what a denial by Johansson! Reaches out and pokes it away! Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Moves it to Stenland. The Panthers gain the zone. Takes the bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Came up with the save on that play. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. He's hit into the wall, and look at this. We're going to get a stoppage here as the whistle's blown. That pane of glass is broken. Well, safety is the first priority, and it was a thunderous hit. And as a result, there's a crack in the pane, and they'll have to replace that, James. The maintenance crew will come out here and make sure that it's taken care of. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. And he loses control of the puck. Battle along the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Here's a chance. Too many bodies in the way. Florida's on the attack. Slides it diagonally to Lister Ryan. Unloads one. Denies him. He got all of it. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Florida's got it in the offensive zone. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Well, this is a huge, timely penalty kill, James. Late in the frame, close game. You gotta get to work, put your work boots on, and you gotta kill this part of the penalty. Florida's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, they've already scored tonight on the PP, James, and looking to really thread the needle again on this one. Their movement, their adjustments have been excellent thus far. Blocked in front. Oh, what a save by Johansson. Well, he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner slot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes the save. 
Unloads a shot. Good stop by Johansson. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Sorelli's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Panthers take possession here inside the offensive zone. That opportunity is rejected. Oh, the play! Wow! Oh, a true competitor save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. They are really tiled in here tonight. Oh, nice save right there. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much-needed stoppage. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. A critical face-off looming here, and let's see if they can maintain that offensive momentum. Well, you know that the defensive side is vulnerable right now with a tired tender, and on the offensive side, you got to recognize that vulnerability and you have to attack the net. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Works it across to Mott. He carries the puck up along the wing. Florida's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Glenn Denning. The Panthers look to start the transition game. It's a two-on-one. Feeds it over. And that's intercepted by Perfect. We've played not one, but two periods now tonight. It's a chance to go grab that final snack. Go stretch your legs, because a big third period is just around the corner. The Bulls are going to need to find a way to manipulate their roster construction here as they're down a player now. That's a tough loss. They're going to have to figure out a way to manage it. Thanks for that update, Cheryl, and you're right. A tough loss indeed. And he takes the dish. Quick pass to Reinhardt. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Tampa Bay's killed the penalty. Well, trailing in this game, James, this was a huge kill. They couldn't lose touch of the game, and they did an awesome job of killing that off. Takes the pass. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off a stick and off target. Great stretch passes and connects. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. Florida's outplayed the opposition tonight, particularly offensively, as they lead it early in this third period. Barkov's won the draw. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. And that's a great hits-up play by Radish. And he can't hang on after that hit. Taken along the wall by Forsling. Florida's got it in their own zone. Center and feed! And that chance is blocked! Kucherov's got the puck through the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to point. Oh, and it stays out! He got a piece of that one! This is where he gets his grade-A opportunities. He's in tight to the goaltender, and usually he executes, but not this time. Tampa Bay is going on the attack as they gain the zone. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Oh, look at this chance. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Quick feed to Paul. Takes a shot. Tremendous stop by Bobrovsky. Well, a nice save by the goaltender, and even better is that he redirects the puck to the corner to safety. Tries to get it over for Lusterinen. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. The Panthers ready to go on the attack. Pass it up ahead. Comes up with the stop. The Hans got it along the boards. Shot! And the lane's clogged up blocking that. From the left wing, takes the feed. The Lightning have it in their own zone. He got all of that one. Yeah, here we go. They didn't like that one bit. They didn't like it because it was dangerous. We can't have that in the game, James. And this fight is sort of a policing, if you will, of the game. And that's why they've dropped the gloves. Oh. 
In a word, spirited from these two rivals. Uh, that's a nice way to put it, James. Every time you hear the boards go, it's an extra shove or it's an extra hit. But these two teams, every time they do it, they just have a little bit more. And that's why a rivalry is what it is. Well, cooler heads finally prevailing here as both teams step inside the face-off circle. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Now a quick pass to DeHaan. Florida's looking to break out of their own end. From the right side, they gain the zone. Centering P, and that's stopped. And he slides it quickly to Mikolov. Makes the save with the glove. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. The Panthers have been active all night in the offensive zone, and they lead it here in this third. Bennett's won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Tampa Bay's gained possession along the boards, and he's ridden off the puck. On the attack along the boards, and it's a quick pass to DeHaan. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Here's a chance up front. And now he moves it quickly to Glenn Denning. Scores! They tie it up! And we are back to even! Well, working hard, sticking to the game plan with good habits, and they're back to evens. You see players work on this all the time in practice, James. It's about getting position, net front, and then once that puck is coming towards you, you gotta get your hands away from the body with great hand-eye coordination. Just get your stick on it. You're not sure where it's going all the time, but this time, it winds up in the back of the net. The Bolts get exactly what they were looking for. A tying goal, and look at this, where we are now in the third. They're back in this game, James. They've shifted the momentum, but it's their urgency. They've been all over the puck. Their first few strides have been hard, and you can tell they want this one. Fantastic save! Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to trap and find the puck. That's without working your opponent and finding a way to make the save. Quick pass across to point. Moves the puck along the half wall. Well, there's not much time here before the goaltender's eyes are taken away, James, and he drops into that butterfly position. All you want to do when you can't see the puck is make yourself as big as possible, but this one has seeing eyes through traffic and finds the back of the net. The Lightning have upped the intensity here in the third period, and they have taken a one-goal lead. Well, the ante hasn't been up, hasn't it? Because they know that the game is almost over, James, but guess what? When you look at the clock, there's still some time, and whenever there's time, your opponent can creep back in, so it's about being conservative in some areas and being aggressive in others. Directed over to Verhage. With some open space here in the neutral zone. Shot! Oh, what a save in front! Moves it to Verhage. Oh, and another big stop! Covers it up, we'll get a stoppage in play. The Panthers still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Let's see what the officials are calling. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. You gotta find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. Stamkos can use his zone ability to help this unit be effective here with the advantage. Let's see if he can light the lamp. Tampa Bay's won the face-up. And he makes a stop with the glove. Moves it quickly over to Ekblad. Another hit. He will feel this one by the end of the night. Oh, a tough night for him. He's going to have to keep his head up and move that puck quickly if he doesn't want to get banged again. Muffs the shot attempt. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. The Lightning have possession along the boards. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. And a solid save on the play there. Bobrovsky's gonna hang on to the puck and get a stoppage in play. Nothing gives confidence to a team more than a big save, and he's been doing it all night, James. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. The Bolts 
win it. Quick pass to Radish. Here's a shot. Makes the save. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Bennett's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. The Bolts take possession off the face-off. Scores! On the minute, Kenny put one hole. And this is exactly why you spend so much time in practice working on specialty teams, James. You can see that good movement to open up lanes, just disrupt the box there, and they're able to cash it in. The Panthers have played well tonight, creating all sorts of scoring chances, but they still trail here in the third. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. He got all of that hit. And he slides it quickly to Purvix. Puck grab by Mikolov. Florida's crossed the line and on the attack. Hagel's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. The Panthers are getting two minutes for tripping. The key to the umbrella on the power play, James, and we saw it earlier, is we have three up high across the ice. You actually pull the coverage up a little bit. If you do that, you can open up cross seams with good motion, but you gotta get the defense running. Florida's penalty killers get a hold of it. Gets the puck in deep. Loses his balance on the play. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Mikolov. Takes a shot. Scores! Well, how's that for killing a penalty? That's turning a PK into a power kill, James. Not just shooting it down the ice. If you have time and space, take advantage with a shorty. Oh man, he's an incredible passer, James. I mean, he's got IQ and awareness, so he knows where he wants to put the puck, so he's one step ahead of everyone. But then it's all about your delivery. You have to give a pass that someone can receive. So the perfect timing or the temperature, you want to make sure that it's flat, it's crisp, and he seems to do it every single time. The Bolts get a hold of the puck off the draw. Florida's got it in their own zone. Moves it over to Barkov. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Solid check to slow him down. Points cross the line and is on the attack now. Picked off by Mr. Ryan. Through center along the wing. And now he angles it across to Ekman Larson. Feeds it over to Hedman. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. And the puck skips off the glove. Oh, and he steps into the line of fire and blocks that. They gain the zone from the left side. Oh, Pat saved tremendous agility there by Johansson. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Tampa Bay's got the win off that draw. The power play only has time for one more rush here. Time is of the essence. You got to get the puck up ice quickly, and you have to gain entry fast. Look at this! Takes a shot! Makes a save! Home. How did that stay out? The Panthers have the advantage in shots tonight, but they still find themselves trailing here in the third period. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Forsling. Gaining momentum along the boards. Here's a shot. Oh, and it makes a save. Just got enough to keep it out. Quick feed to Paul. Trying to gain separation. Bobrovsky's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Quite the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Who wins? Carla Bain has her answer. Kucherov's helped his team out by getting in on the scoring. He's had the stronger performance, in my opinion, guys. Puck scooped up by Ekblad. Forsling's gaining momentum. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Moves it to point. Oh, a clutch save! One-time shot. Tremendous athletic. 
Dominic stopped with the glove by Bobrovsky. Some last second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Hans looking for space along the blue line. That's in the back of the net for an own goal. James, how surprised do you think the goaltender is? He just spins around and tries to clear the puck and he fires it past the tender. Tampa Bay's in the driver's seat now, up by two in this third period. Oh yeah, and it's been a consistent effort from start to finish here, James. Now they gotta make sure that they play this last little bit the same way they started. Aggressive on the puck, but be cautious when they need to. Sometimes the simple play is the effective one. The Bolts take it across the blue line. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Cousins. Tampa Bay's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Bolts take it along the wing. Takes the feed. Shot! He scores! And he completes the hat trick! Well, uh, he's been zipping and buzzing along the ice this entire night. Happy James, and man, do the fans appreciate him. Sometimes when it looks effortless, it's actually a lot harder than it seems. I mean, this is quite a play to be able to make that move and then slide that puck over to his teammate who executes and finishes it off perfectly. The Bolts are having themselves a night, and they probably don't want this one to end, Pounder. Nah, I wouldn't. If you're patting the stats and you're putting up these kind of numbers, I mean, from start to finish, they've imposed their will on their opponent. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the wall. Tampa Bay's been running away with this one since the beginning of the game and no signs of slowing down in the third. It's been a productive night and this is one of those games that gives everyone confidence and this is important for your lineup as everyone gets it as they feel like they're contributing. Here's a shot and it comes up with the save. The Bolts have been extremely entertaining tonight, James, and it looks like they're really buying into the coaching staff's philosophy here. They made adjustments, they've been dynamic with the puck, and most importantly, they've been hard on it. Here we go, on man rush. Battle along the boards. Directs it on over to Asimo. Poked away by Forsling. Florida's looking to break out. The Lightning have the puck in the defensive zone. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. And makes the save. Sorelli's got to find a way to physically and emotionally engage without his fist, James. I mean, you know how effective and how valuable he is when he's on the ice. I mean, look at that scoring chance he just generated. The setters will glide into the dot. Tampa Bay's got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. And now he tries to get it across to Mott. Great read with the stick. The Panthers are across the line and into the offensive end. And they score! Well, this is just a fantastic shot, knowing exactly where to put that puck low blocker side. Every goaltender is going to tell you it's one of the most difficult ones to stop. The Panthers are showing a little pride here in the third. And really, that's all that it's about right now. This game is over, and you can see they just want this game and the clock to tick down. They want that final buzzer to go. 
They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Here's a shot, and he gets in front of the slot shot to make the save. Jocelyn for the puck, and it's knocked away. Sets it out front. Misses the net. Let's it fly. Comes up with the stop. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. Scooped up along the wall by Barre Poulet. Quick pass to Kulikov. The Bolts gain control of the puck against the wall. Through the neutral zone and along the boards, here they come. Grabbed along the boards by Point. Here's a short pass to Hagel. Moves it to the middle. And he elects not to shoot it and hang on to the puck. Poked away in the offensive end. Takes it to the front. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. Centers are set, face off, ready to resume play. Points got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Off a stick. Picked up along the boards by Kulikov. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Up along the wing. Here they come on the rush. Takes it into the slot. Fires it. to a perfectly executed shot as he sets up and waits for it right in his wheelhouse. Just lets the one-timer rip. Florida's won the faceoff at center. The Panthers scoop it up along the boards. And as the final seconds tick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. What a steal in his own end. And that will close the book on this one here tonight. Well, that was about as big a belly flop as I've seen in a third period in a long time, Cheryl. Well, listen, you're in control of the game, and you come out like that, incredibly flat. The coach certainly isn't going to like it. They're going to be skating tomorrow. And the party's not over just yet, Pounder. Look at them. Here they come back out onto the ice. you got to love it. Just a fun night all the way around, and they've stuck around, and they stick around, and so does their team. They come back out on the ice to say thank you and salute them. Well, on behalf of Cheryl Pounder, my broadcast partner, my name is James Savalski. Thank you so much for joining us. A fun night of hockey tonight, and we look forward to bringing you more action soon. See you.